British Prime Minister Keir Starmer arrived in Washington on Friday for talks with President Joe Biden that will include Ukraine's request to use Western-supplied weapons against targets inside Russia. Starmer said on his way to the US that Britain does not seek any conflict with Russia. Russia started this conflict. Russia illegally invaded Ukraine. Russia could end this conflict straight away, he told reporters. Nearly 200 people have died in Vietnam in the aftermath of Typhoon Yagi and more than 125 are missing as flash floods and landslides take their toll, state media reported Thursday. Vietnam's VN Express newspaper reported that 197 people have died and 128 are still missing, while more than 800 have been injured. Most of the casualties were caused by floods and landslides in Vietnam's northern mountainous provinces. In the capital, flood waters from the Red River receded slightly but many areas were still inundated. In Hanoi's Tay Ho district, people waded through muddy brown water above their knees to make their way along one street, some still wearing their bicycle and motorcycle helmets after abandoning their vehicles. Local residents started to evacuate from Tuesday evening. Electricity and tap water has been cut since Wednesday. People who remain in the area waded through the flooded streets to collect food and other supplies while waiting for the flood waters to recede. Yagi was the strongest typhoon to hit Vietnam in decades. It made landfall Saturday with winds of up to 149 km per hour. Despite weakening on Sunday, downpours continued and rivers remain dangerously high. The flooding in Hanoi has been reportedly the worst in two decades and has led to widespread evacuations. The Southeast Asian country continues to suffer the consequences of the typhoon that hit the north of the country during the weekend, with rain and gusts of wind exceeding 150 km per hour. The flooding, unprecedented in decades, has reached Hanoi, where the Red River has forced the evacuation of hundreds of people. According to Mai Van Kiem, director of the National Meteorological Forecasting Center, the river has reached its highest level since 2004. At least 155 people have died in Vietnam after the passage of the Typhoon Yagi. Major flooding has also affected neighboring countries Thailand and Laos. ngập lụt hết không có gia đình không có nước sinh hoạt uống buộc phải mua nước lọc và dự trữ cháu nó mang đến vì kéo về thôi vì nước sâu quá nước máy cũng không có tắt hết Giờ không đun nấu gì được mình phải mua những cái đồ chín nữa. Khó khăn thì tất nhiên là có nhiều rồi, bây giờ thiếu điện, thiếu nước Rồi còn à, ăn uống thì nó phải cứ vì tôm trường kỳ thôi Không có gì cả, nhưng mà vấn đề chủ yếu là sau này, sau nước vùng ngục này đấy thì dọn dẹp với bà con rồi mới thống kê được thiệt hại.
ở trên này nó ngập lút lụt quá đấy sau cuối cùng là mình lại chuyển sang bên Âu Cơ Âu Cơ về hiện tại bây giờ là mình đang ở tạm bên đấy còn đâu là chuyện à, lúc lũ như thế này mình chẳng làm ăn được gì cả bánh trái các thứ cũng hỏng hết Thank uh -huh. 